What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new video. I know what you're thinking, study, this is a double upload, you just recorded a video about the Josh Taylor render, I know, I know. But this is a big shout out to Tio in the Discord, as I know not everyone is in the Discord, because I know everyone uses it, which is completely fine, which is why I always update you guys on pretty much everything. And big shout out to Tio, like I said, he found the new website. As you guys know, we've had esportsboxingclub.com for ages, but he found playundisputed.com. And on this website, there's various features talking about the, the roster, talking about the um, innovative and authentic gameplay, as well as four new screenshots, one of which shows actual in-game damage which we haven't seen for ages so i knew i had to um make a video talking about this i'm going to talk about a few of the things on the website but i will leave a link down below if you guys want to go and check out the website yourself but i thought you know i know not i know some people just prefer to watch videos about these things so i thought i would make a video on it so we're going to jump straight into the best part which is the photos so we're going to jump into this first one which is my least favorite of the bunch this of katie taylor uh, in the walkout She's obviously walking towards the camera. Just not a fan of this. I just think, you know, obviously it's just a kind of an ugly capture of the way she's moving. But it looks good. It's just like, you know, she's just walking, I suppose, kind of funny. But the model still looks great. And then if we jump to, um, speaking of walkout, we jump to this one of the venue. Kind of a, a theater, York Hall kind of thing. Doesn't seat millions, just seats maybe a thousand or so. Um, we can see the cameraman, the ringside officials, we can see someone in the alley of the walkout, we can't see who, but we can see someone in the walkout, all the lights around, good atmosphere, like, I like it, hopefully this is something that will be in early access, then if we jump to this one of Smoking Joe Frazier, in his corner, this is obviously pre-fight with the announcer, you know, Smoking Joe, we can see he's got his corner men with him, which is awesome. They're going to be in, you know, in our corner, which is what we wanted, um, which means that they're in right now. So I assume for early access, the corner man will also be there, which is very cool. We see him with his old school gloves on. He looks good. He looks mean. Very exciting stuff. And then we jump to my favorite one, which is probably what this video is titled around. And that is Rocky Marciano with a nasty cut on his eyebrow, bleeding down his face. And that just looks awesome. I know we've been waiting to see some damage. We haven't seen in-game damage for fucking ages. So it's great to see. We can see like almost like the splatter of blood, uh, you know, with the cut there, the splatter of blood on the face. He's got the old school gloves on, his old school shorts. He looks brilliant. Right now, Rocky Marciano hasn't been announced for early access day one. He, we obviously know he's in the game, but he hasn't been announced for early access day one. But good to see a lot of emotion on the face, a nasty cut. His eye is kind of closed. Uh, mouth open, bleeding down the face, it looks absolutely awesome. Four really cool screenshots, can't complain, the new website looks absolutely awesome. Like I said guys, go check it out for yourselves, I'm not going to go through everything, uh, I just wanted to show you guys the main parts. And then we've got this part about the roster, These, this is the only part you can really do, which is Katie Taylor, Sonny Edwards and Ryan Garcia, and it says more than 50 early access fighters. Check back for updates as the full early access roster is revealed. So there's more than 50, and obviously it says Katie Taylor and Sonny Edwards both champions, which is cool. Uh, and then obviously Ryan Garcia as well. So I assume the assumption at the minute is now obviously once we get the early access roster, we're going to get the early access release date, which is also really cool. And then we're going to go down to the last bit that I really want to talk about, which is features. And we've got here, it says features, innovative and authentic gameplay. We've taken great care to make sure Undisputed looks and feels like boxing should. What you can expect. And there is six bullet points. First one is revolutionary footwork mechanics, including a loose movement modifier to help you get around the ring with ease. And we've got more than 60 individual punches. Punch from multiple angles and directions. Feint to set up a trap and counter. And we've got 50 plus licensed fighters at the start of early access with more to come, including a fully fledged women's division. And we've got incredibly detailed boxer models utilizing the latest scanning technology. We've got the WBC, British Boxing Board of Control and other real life boxing organizations. And the final one, boxing equipment and apparel brands such as Empire Pro Take, Rival, Cleto Rays and Adams, which is very very cool man it's great some some you know a lot of this we do know but it's good for people that are coming there they they the, the well that sounds a bit weird that are coming people that are that are, are learning about the game and are new to it they're they're coming into a great website 
with lots of information, which I just think is brilliant. Uh, they also show the Deontay Wilder um, kind of trailer that moving in the background, which I think is awesome. Then we've also just got for frequently asked questions, there's when can I play on what platforms will Undisputed be available and how long will early access last? When can I play says we are first launching into early access on PC and plan to announce a date soon. Be sure to follow our social channels so you don't miss updates. The platforms, obviously we know it's Xbox, Series X, Series S, PS4, PS5 and PC. And then how long will early access last, which is a lot of what you guys asked me. They're pretty much just saying we don't know. When we release the full version of Undisputed, when we feel it's ready. That means achieving certain milestones, reaching a certain level of quality, we feel it is up to our standards and incorporates feedback from players. With that in mind, it can be tough to predict exactly how long early access will last. We plan to add additional content and features along the way, and that will take time. So it's a great website and I mainly want to talk about the images, but I just thought we'd cover a few little, little text based things here. And I thought I'm not going to waste my time and upload it tomorrow. I'll just get it out to you guys right now. So it should drop about 11 p.m. tonight. Um, it looks good though. Like I said, I'm going to leave the website link in the description. Shout out again to TI for finding it. None of us thought to Google playundisputed.com. Don't know why, but we just didn't. But whoever made the website... Fair play to you. It's a great website. You know, shout out to the Steel City Interactive team. Really kind of getting on this train, getting on this early access momentum. And yeah, some good images. Good to see damage. And like I said, I assume the things we're seeing, such as cor cornermen in your corner, um, little venues like this, damage. These things are early access. Th these things are in-game now, so why wouldn't they be in early access? That's where my brain goes. But let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Um, and yeah. Thanks always for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. The support's being crazy at the minute. Much love to you all. And yeah, drop a like, subscribe if you're new. And yeah, let me know your thoughts um, on the new the new images. I, I, I quite like the damage. I'm hoping at some point we see like a real fucking busted up dude. Like, just blood everywhere. <laughs> I'm really hoping we see a bit like the Gabriel Rosado and Triple G fight. I'm hoping we just see like an absolute massacre at some point. But for now, a nice cut, bit of blood splatter. I'll take it. It's better than just no damage whatsoever. But anyways, thanks always for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.